Some interesting facts. AC motors are used heavily in fan and pumping applications. Many of these applications are in heavy fluid areas such as car washes, water pumping, etc. In such applications, the AC motor is susceptible to failure due to fluid ingress. In other words, the motor shorts. Once water or other fluids penetrate the AC motor, we will see a phase-to-phase -phase short. Another common fault is phase-to-ground faults. When run across the line off of a standard starter, these short circuit faults blow the protection fuses or trip breakers. When a variable frequency drive is running a motor, a phase-to-phase -phase or phase-to-ground fault also shorts the VFD's output. In most cases, this short will cause a catastrophic failure on the VFD's output transistor section. In other words, it fries the VFD. The result is an added downtime due to a failed motor and now a failed VFD. Solution. Mitsubishi VFDs have intelligent transistor packs that sense phase-to-phase -phase and phase-to-ground faults quickly, even on low-horsepower, low-cost VFDs. Mitsubishi VFDs also utilize fast digital signal processors, or DSPs, to identify the short and shut off the output transistors, even on low-horsepower, low-cost VFDs. This protects the VFD, fix the motor short, reset the fault, and you're up and running again. So how do you set up ground fault protection on a Mitsubishi VFD? First, stop the VFD. On the VFD's HMI operator panel, hit the mode button until the parameter mode indication comes up and it should say P0. Turn the rotary dial on the same operator panel until the display says P249. Hit the set button. Spin the same rotary dial until the display reads 1. Hit the set button again. That's it, you are done. Hit the mode button to exit the parameter mode. What happens when a ground fault occurs in a motor? We've just activated ground fault protection on the Mitsubishi VFD. Now we've wired one of the phases to ground through this switch. I just completed the path and shorted the phase to ground. Let's go ahead and start it. Now you're seeing an EGF, which is an earth to ground fault. Let's correct the short by flipping the switch. Press stop. It resets the fault. Press run. You're up and running. Problem is solved. For further assistance or additional questions, please feel free to call Gulf Controls Company at 1-800-282-9125.